you can see there's one, two, three, four, five, at least five combs in there right now. Here you go, Richard. Um, try to press this up over here. Well, I don't think I told you. I was doing some uh, figuring last night about when I planted those trees. Yeah? I think it was probably more like five weeks. <laughs> and who knows how long they've been there before I found them. Well, we'll see what we end up with. Oh, can you see that in there? I could say uh, a couple huh? of billion. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Carl Sagan. Good job, Matt. Save that material. Okay, I'm gonna have to put this flat bar in my pocket or something. There you go. I'll make a carpenter out of you yet. Yeah. So you got a wedge right there. Will that wedge come out? There, that thing. What's that? No? It's what's holding the beehive together. <laughs> yeah. It's apparently a very important piece. Yeah. It's actually just a... Is it scrap or...? Yeah. It's a scrap piece to make it everything fit. But I right. Really pry it apart, I think. Yeah. You probably got a staple in it. I got some nippers here, mate. I'm gonna take these, take these nippers and separate that, um, pull that staple that's it, holding it together. There it is. It's gonna be ter terrible video footage, by the way. Yeah, mine, mine too. Mine too. <laughs> okay, there we got it. Oh, look, it's the soaked wedge. in honey. That's propolis actually on there. So. You can see this is all the uh, where all the combs are ripped off. They're full of honey. Really good looking stuff. So it looks like you had a mud wasp in there the bees killed too. <laughs> you want to take that and I'll take some shots of inside the hive. Just set it on the ground over there by those. Yeah. Okay, so we're going back in there pretty far. This is where we get the vacuum out and suck out as many as we can. Yeah, you can if you want. I'm gonna pause the video for now. And... There's a lot in there. It's really pretty. Hi. It's a really pretty comb. So this is the comb we've removed so far, and this is the comb that we're looking at and how far it goes back there. So it goes back there about uh, another foot after this. So we'll continue on. So what we've done so far we got the bees pretty much cleared out of there all their combs gone and see how far back they went a little box the owner says they're here about five weeks he thinks so 
scraped off most of what we could. We're going to close it back up. Caulk it back up so the bees can't get back in.